Well, you know that President Trump and China's president are here in South Florida, but there's another big name here. We're talking U.S. Education Secretary Betsy DeVos. She's touring schools. And Local 10's Glenna Milberg is live now at FIU's main campus with more on this educational tour. Glenna. Victor Janine, U.S. Education Secretary Betsy DuVos is making a swing through South Florida for the next two days. Today she went to three schools, this here at FIU, the first public university she has visited yet. And the people here, the administrators, the president, the students, they took the opportunity to show her what federal funding could do here. And you may not find any you'll want to go down. First stop and photo op was a Christian school in Miami, the kind of private school that accepts Florida's tax credit vouchers for low-income students, a program U.S. Education Secretary Betsy DeVos called a model to be looked at. And behind you, you'll see another model. In what may be her most significant stop today, the secretary got a first-hand look at the hands-on nursing program at Florida International University, her first visit to a public university where concerns of federal funding cuts are top of mind. I think it was great that she could see students who benefited from that funding and she could hear from faculty directly about what they've done with those dollars. A smattering of student protesters took issue with the new secretary's lack of educational experience and her support for school choice and charter programs that divert resources from the public system. This administration has committed to taking a bigger picture, larger look at the entirety of the federal government and the way the federal government invests in this country and to ensuring that we um, look anew at what things are actually working, what things are not. A lot of talk here too today between the correlation and the relationship between education and workforce and labor. And remember, FIU is where Alex Acosta used to be the law dean and is now the U.S. Secretary of Labor. So look for a lot of talk about that. I'm Glenna Milberg, live at FIU in West Miami Day today, Local 10 News. All right, Glenna, thank you.